Hey, hey, blessings, prayer warriors. God bless you on this Sunday, February 12th. My goodness, already 12th. Hey, today is football Sunday. If you got a jersey or a team t-shirt or something like that, any sport, it's just going to be a fun day with the word of God going forth. Invite a friend. It's going to be awesome. Amen. So our Bible reading is Matthew 26, 26 through 44. And look at verse 26. And as they were eating, Jesus took bread, blessed and broke it, and gave it to the disciples and said, Take, eat, this is my body. Then he took the cup, he gave thanks, he gave it to them, saying, Drink from it, all of you, for this is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for many for the remission of sins. Woo-hoo! Then he makes this statement. But I say to you, I will not drink of the fruit of the vine from now on until the day when I drink it new with you in my Father's kingdom. He's waiting for us to get there, and we're going to enjoy a great marriage supper of the Lamb. Amen. Amen. All right. Our nation we're praying for is Ireland and North Ireland. Please pray for the Christian ministries in Ireland as they continue to welcome and support refugees fleeing from Ukraine who continue to enter the island in a steady flow. Please pray that God would guide the believers in prayer in word in action as they minister to those to these broken and tired people. And I just see the video and the stuff of Ukraine They're projecting something huge in the next two weeks. So let's stay in prayer. Uh, Turkey, over 25,000 have passed away. Tens of thousands are injured. Our world is in shambles. Let's pray. Father, again, as we see these things in our, our world, you told us, Lord, to continue to look up. Thank you that you know the end from the beginning. You gave us great warning. You told us, be not deceived, many will come in your name. You said, Lord, that there'll be a great delusion. You said lawlessness would abound. You said uh, parents would not even have an affection towards their children, that children would be disobedient to their parents. You said that we would go after strange flesh on and on and on and on. But I thank you that we hold on to your word and we stay true to you. We love you in the midst of cuckoo-ness, Lord, when a billion people will be shouting and uh, hollering at a football game today. I'm going to shout for Jesus today. Hallelujah. 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 We lift up these commercials tonight, Lord, during this football game, and we pray that it can spark uh, something in people to want to search a little further, Lord. And I thank you, thank you for that. We lift up the nation of Ireland and North Ireland as the the people from Ukraine or refugees from Ukraine that had beautiful homes and now are caught up in a mess, Lord. Oh, we pray for these poor people, Lord. We pray for them. Lord, 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 we pray an end of this. We pray peace on earth. We know what the scripture says, but we pray for people's lives, Lord, and we know as we get closer and closer to the return of the king, that there'll be more wars and rumors of wars. There'll be more earthquakes and natural disasters. And Lord, they want to blame it on this and that. How do you blame an earthquake on what they say? Oh, Lord, help us as a people. Help us, Lord. We pray today, Father, our prayer focus is the church. We lift up our two services today at 9 and 11. We lift up every church service where the gospel is going forth. And Lord, I don't even need to say that because where the gospel is not going forth, it's not even a church. So we pray that the gospel would go forth in power. We lift up our United States of America, that people's eyes would be open. We lift up our world before you, Father. We pray for Ukraine, we pray for Russia, we pray for Turkey, we pray over these situations, and we thank you again, Lord, just for a touch from heaven, Lord, a touch from heaven. 
We pray, Father, for people, Lord, 8 billion people on planet Earth, and they say approximately 1 to 2 billion are born again. So that means there's at least 6 billion people that are not saved. So we pray for them, for the truth of the gospel to come forth, and we thank you for that. We lift up the prayer cards that have come in this week, Lord. And this card that was mailed in, I pray for this person who's praying for their child who they believe is uh, their daughter who they believe is becoming sexually active. Oh, Lord, what a world we live in. What a world we live in, Lord. We pray, we pray over the needs of this, this mother, this household, Lord. We pray for wisdom. We pray over all the prayer cards that have come in for the needs of brothers and sisters, Lord, that we would stop complaining and that we'll keep praying. Hallelujah! 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 Again, we lift up our services to you, that Jesus be glorified. This is not about man, not about personality. It's all about our Jesus. Oh, we love him so dearly. Come on, prayer warriors, do you love him dearly? Hallelujah! We love you, we love you, we love you, we love you, we love you. We send up hearts, Lord, hearts of love to you, Lord. Oh, how we love you. We love you, Lord. Now, we thank you for this day, Lord, and we thank you that in all things we can glorify the King of kings and the Lord of lords. I pray for my precious uh, church family, uh, prayer warriors today, Lord. I pray your blessings upon them. You, the Lord, you bless us and keep us. You, the Lord, you make your face shine upon us and you are gracious to us. You, the Lord, you lift up your confidence upon us and you give us your sweet shalom, shalom. We receive that. We love you and we pray that many can come to the saving knowledge of Jesus Christ at CFFC, but every church, Lord, we thank you, thank you for that. Thank you that we can celebrate Jesus and maybe today that trumpet will sound. Who knows? We love you. That's our blessed hope and I'll never let go of it. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. We are looking up, living in crazy warp speed days. Why? Because scripture is being fulfilled. Amen and amen. Woo, raise a hallelujah. Louder and louder to our King. Amen. God bless you, prayer warriors. Hope to see you at church in a little bit. Or if it's watching this later, hope you enjoyed service today. God bless. He is risen. He is risen indeed. God bless.